The Sumida, one of Tokyo's most iconic rivers. One of Japan's Class A rivers, the Sumida River flows from the Shin Iwabuchi floodgate, where it separates from the Arakawa River to Tokyo Bay. In the Edo period, Tokyo prospered as a city on water. The river supported people's lives in every way. The Sumida River is celebrated as a place of recreation for the common people, with fireworks and pleasure crafts, and in culture as the subject of paintings. Yes, the Sumida River is a timeless presence, enduring today as a symbol of Tokyo. But with repeated heavy rains and storm surges, it has also been the scene of great flood damage. This flood damage, combined with removal of groundwater, has caused the surrounding ground to subside. To address this problem, vertical concrete seawalls were erected, making the river safer. But while building these seawalls secured the river safety, they also weakened the bonds between the people and the river. So the Tokyo Metropolitan Government set to work creating waterside spaces that would attract people and bring excitement to the river's banks. Super levees and esplanades were created with safety and people-friendly riverside designs so that people could reconnect with the waterside. Lighting was installed in the esplanades so that people could stroll along the banks, enjoying the evening view. The river once again became a place for public use. As in Kyoto in the summer, a kawayuka, or riverside esplanade, could now be installed on the Sumida River. In 2020, a new waterside attraction opened, Ryogoku River Center. Private sector activity created a mixed-use complex with a hotel and restaurant, while the addition of a super levee and disaster prevention piers provided protection against natural disasters as well as a people-friendly riverside design. The disaster prevention piers can be used on ordinary days as well as in times of disaster. Besides Sumida Park, new spots embracing the riverside are opening one after another. Fostering the creation of spaces where people can once again gather and enjoy the water's edge. We hope that the Sumida River, as a precious open space in the heart of the city, will continue to be a soothing and welcoming presence for Tokyo, residents and visitors. That's the desire of the Tokyo Metropolitan Government.